Hey guys, Dark Matter from Bedlam Brothers here and welcome to the Nightwing episode of School of Legends. Today I'm going to be looking at Nightwing. He can be purchased for 35 marks of legend from the Legends vendor. Nightwing's movement mode is acrobatics. This means he can sprint across the ground, use grappling hook to travel faster, climb walls and ceilings and has a type of flight. Nightwing's health is 6880. This seems to be the base HP for characters I've tested so far. As with all characters, blocking counters your opponent's lunge attacks. Throughout the series, you'll see each character's lunges, so take note and learn when to block. Nightwing's combat style is the dual wield, which is pretty special for Legends, as the majority of characters are brawling and martial arts. His lunge moves you closer to the target and counters any range attacks. As always, you should take a moment to look at Nightwing's combo list. One thing to mention, the Ultra Flurry combo doesn't work for Nightwing. You can press the buttons and you will do a combo and the last hit will lunge an opponent, but the animation and associated damage doesn't correspond to the actual combo. For comparison, here's me using the Ultra Flurry combo. As you'll notice, the spinning animation and damage is completely absent when Nightwing uses it. Because dual wheel combos can execute a lunge or block break at any time, this makes it a hard weapon to predict and gives you a wide variety of ways to trick your opponent. As an example, you could throw out a 6 hit combo, making your opponent thinking it's time to block. At that point, use your range attack to block break. On that note, there's two combos I'd like to point out. The first is called Stunning Swipe, which can activate a lunge on the 4th, 5th and 6th strike that stuns and deals decent damage. The next combo is called Dual Flurry, which can also activate a lunge on the 7th, 8th and 9th strike for considerable damage. These combos can be clipped at any point, cutting the animation short, allowing time to get started on the next attack. It is important to note that these combos can be blocked. With Dual Wield, tapping range attack will block break a blocking opponent and is still vulnerable to being launched. The held range attack for Dual Wield can be held indefinitely, which can also block break. This attack is also susceptible to being launched. It is important to vary between melee and range attacks in order to trick your opponent and make sure you win the counter for your immunities. Moving on to Nightwing's power moves starting from left to right. The first is called Taser Line. This damages, stuns and pulls a single target towards you. The second is called Wing Ding Flurry. This damages multiple enemies in the direction you're looking at, stunning and knocking them down. The third is called a Screamer Slam. This is a close range AoE attack that knocks back your opponents. This move is usable while controlled. The next move is called Clink. This move encases a single target in a yellow bubble causing damage. Enemies can break out of this bubble if they have power. If your opponent is out of power, they won't be able to break out and will remain in the bubble for some time. Most damage won't get through the bubble, but your tapped range attack will. So if you manage to catch someone out of power, you can tap your range attack to pile on the damage. The next move is called forward flip. This deals basic damage and a knockdown effect. Helpless enemies will take additional damage. And the last move is back flip, dealing basic damage and a knockback effect. Helpless enemies will take additional damage. Overall, Nightwing's a fairly strong character. His power set isn't particularly impressive although none of the moves are vulnerable to block or interrupt, which is a definite bonus. The main benefit of Nightwing is that he's a dual wield user. I can't emphasize enough how important it is to be competent with the dual wield in order to be effective with Nightwing. If you can master his versatile melee style and clip his relevant powers, you can get off big damage and be a fierce Legends player. So why not give Nightwing a go and leave a comment to let me know how you got on. Until next time, stay legendary.